We've got a really quick tip today for anyone who emails forms out of Sage 50. Uh, whether it's invoices like I'm doing here or a sales order, quote, purchase order, whatever it may be. Um, if you find yourself editing this email, uh, whether you're just um, you're adding a signature or whether you're uh, just completely rewriting it, um, there's a way that you can now change the, the standard uh, email text for each type of form. So we'll go back to Sage 50 and in the maintain menu just go to email setup and here, here you've got a list of each of the types of forms that you can email out of Sage 50. As you click on each one you see you get a different message over here. So you can customize each one of those, uh, make them read however you want. You can include your signature in there so you don't have to add it in the email. Whatever you want to do with it. Um, it is plain text though so you can't do any fancy formatting there's no html uh, you also can't insert database fields like a customer name or something like that to try to personalize it. Um, it it's just simple text but there is a lot of space in there i was experimenting with it trying to find uh, how much you know how many characters you can put in there and i gave up counting and um, so there, there's going to be plenty of room whether you've got a, an elaborate signature line or you like to put in some uh, long legal disclaimer that nobody's ever read, there's going to be plenty of room for it there. You don't have to worry about that. I guess the other thing uh, you should be aware of is that these are company-wide settings. So um, you can't have different, uh, different email messages for each user. Um, but at least you've got a way to customize that now we never did before. So I hope you find that helpful.